Hello, uh, thanks for catching our video. My name is Khalil Turner. I'm with LandPearl.com, my little uh, land sales website uh, where I sell rural vacant land from mostly the southwest United States. Today I'm going to uh, be talking about uh, some property I have for sale over in the Black Mesa area of Rio Arriba County. It's a very unique area. and uh, But just to kind of situate you here, uh, we're in Google Earth right now and uh, as you can see this is the Black Mesa area where the properties are located uh, it's about a thousand feet you can see your elevation over here here's the top elevation and the bottom below it's about a thousand feet difference between there so any any view you have up there you're out looking across all the valley and you've got a gorgeous view all around you uh, but the Black Mesa area is situated between uh, Santa Fe, which uh, here at Española here is, is nearby, but uh, Santa Fe is here, and then you have Taos over here. So uh, kind of in between the two, both very trendy, uh, very uh, uh, hip, uh, social, uh, art scene kind of, kind of places. But um, and there's also some little wineries here in a local area nearby. If you'd like to check that out, there are local wineries and a few little restaurants here and there, little quaint places. But, but to get back to the property, um, so the, these are the three tracks we have. Uh, these two tracks are 9.4 acres. This one is 4.85 acres, all for sale. These two are uh, priced around 42.50. This one I think close to $3,000. Also available owner financing, but. Uh, these are unique tracks in that um, they're situated on the Mesa and again you have gorgeous views all around I'll give you a couple of views this is the Rio Grande that spreads all throughout the you know rolls around the, the Mesa here um, some more views of the Rio Grande so I can't grab another one so those are the kind of views you have looking out across the, the valley there um, the the properties uh, the, if you can see right here you can see grid marks in the top of the property and there's actually uh, also if you, if you see this uh, so I can't find it here these are this these tracks right here there's uh, power lines that run through the top of the Mesa but anyway uh, the grid lines that you see here this property all throughout this area was originally uh, slated in the 60s and early 70s for a, a large residential development and developer had come in here and developed this area uh, cut all these grid marks into it sold a lot of lots off and intended to put some residential property up here but the developer kind of went belly up and just never happened the, the development never caught fire and uh, as a result um, it, it, it's it's still largely vacant land and Rio Reba, Rio Reba has some pretty pricey property throughout the county uh, you can still pick up land in this area pretty inexpensively and you get it with a fantastic views all around this is a great area to camp to hike up here fantastic hiking and lots of things to see on the Mesa there's wild horses that roam this area there's a, a cattle uh, guy that I think has some cattle grazing up here open grazing land some areas um, you access the property here you, you see right here this highway 582 there there are more than one access points there's an access point to get on top of the maze right in this area that's for a cattle farmer and, and for access a uh, uh, a tower up here that, that's not for the general general public the uh, the access road that you're going to want to take is right here this county road 57 and I'll give you a let you look to see what it looks like here from the road off of this 291 can't see if I can't uh, get to it well there it is so that's what the access road looks like uh, from the road but anyway um, so you access it there there this property is gated uh, they're only landowners uh, as you come up here there'll be a gate and you can't get past it unless you have a, a, a key to the gate 
I do have a key and I can when you talk to me and call me and we discuss the property I can arrange for you to have access to go and view the property but um, the it, it, there's a gate there in, in large part because this is actually an ancient site it's a, of historical value there are petroglyphs all along the edges of this thing all over the place there are thousands of petroglyphs and when I say petroglyphs I mean they're ancient inscriptions on rocks and all kind of little rock formations that Native Americans over a thousand years ago maybe longer maybe a little bit less but uh, some of them at least a thousand years put uh, uh, inscriptions all along the major just recording their lives and things that were going on um, this site again was settled way, way before Americans uh, uh, had settled here uh, later I think at one point uh, during the Civil War there may have been a post up here I'm not certain about that but regardless uh, th this was an ancient site and uh, one of the gentlemen that I sold a, a property to a while back about a year ago uh, who camps out here regularly and has a, a little RV site uh, up here uh, he tells me that there are actually some caves along here it's a little tricky to get to uh, you gotta be really careful but there are also uh, some little caves and again petroglyphs everywhere so much to explore and see up here if you're into history this is a great property uh, to, to scope around and again you cannot access it unless you are a landowner there's actually an organization called Mesa de Prieta which protects the petroglyphs up here and if you just bear with me I'm, I'm going to switch over to a, a website they have um, here we see a website that they, uh, this is some, some examples of the petroglyphs that they have up there uh, let's see if I can't show you some more here, here's some other petroglyphs they have so uh, these are the sort of things that are all around the, uh, the Mesa and for you to, to, to see uh, as a landowner uh, if you're gonna go up there and hike there um, so that kind of gives you a good feel for the property and the uniqueness of it uh, most folks don't know about the petroglyphs and that just right there in their backyard they're just uh, uh, ancient markers all over the place uh, really beautiful area beautiful view gorgeous views I showed you the Rio Grande that runs through there you can't beat the price uh, I can also do some owner financing for you um, if you'd like to, to purchase some of these properties. Uh, great for uh, camping, uh, hiking, RVing. I've had folks uh, purchase property up here to, to, to use their uh, ATVs and check things out. Uh, but, uh, but really just a great place to uh, uh, camp RV out there and just enjoy the serenity of it all. And uh, I look forward to hearing from you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And you can always contact me at uh, service at landpearl.com or click on one of my listing pages and contact me there via email. Thanks so much and have a great day.